Aloha lovelies, Tony with you here on Inspire All Out Loud. Today we're going to talk about stress and digestion. In my book Detoxify for Vibrant Health, I mention digestion as one of the main ways your body eliminates toxins. But what you eat is only part of the picture. How you eat is almost as important. So cruising on Easy Street is your destination for effective digestion. If you are stressed, the body goes back in time to the good old days of living in the wild, surrounded by potential dangers at every turn. Any threats spark a stress response in the body, with cortisol being pumped through our blood to prolong the effect of the adrenaline to keep us on our toes. This is great when there's a giant bear or a herd of angry goats heading your way and you need to move fast. It saved my life once when I had an Alsatian dog hot on my heels one night in Brisbane. Seriously, my feet barely touched the ground. But during times of stress, the non-survival processes in our body shut down, including our digestion. And chronic unmitigated stress from work, domestic and social life can mean our bodies are perpetually in fight or flight mode. Eating while you are stressed is not only inefficient, but it can cause inflammation, immune issues and other health disorders. So how can you relax before eating food? First of all, just eat. Don't run, don't drive, don't snack during a game of tennis. Just sit your ass down and eat. Many cultures know to sit as food and water are not absorbed so well when you're standing. Sitting upright with a straight spine allows room in your belly for your food to begin turning into you. And if you're able to kneel on the ground rather than sit on a chair, that actually stretches the stomach meridian on the outer front of the thighs, which in Chinese medicine aids digestion. Number two, don't drink and bite. Barbara O'Neill says that liquid dilutes the stomach acid and food cannot be digested till the stomach is full of acid again. So digestion has to wait till the liquids are processed out. So drink water 30 minutes before eating to flush away old digestive enzymes and then try not to drink for 90 minutes afterwards to allow the food to fully digest. Number three, what else are you taking in? Sitting down and watching violence and anger on YouTube is not exactly relaxing and will keep that cortisol pumping. Preferably, sit in a peaceful silence while you eat or if you must entertain yourself with something on YouTube or by reading, at least make it something lovely. Number four, watch what you think. Vita Austin's amazing work with water shows that our thoughts literally imprint into water. So your thoughts and emotions while making and eating food actually affect its structure. So think nice thoughts. Number five, breathe. Amanda Vollmer explained in one video that slow, deep breathing actually tells your body it is safe because you can't actually breathe slowly and deeply when you are on the run from a big, scary beast. So this is a really easy way to signal your body to just settle down. You only need a few long, slow, deep breaths to reset your nervous system and get your belly ready for food. So that's five little tips for you today. I hope that's helpful. If you have any other ideas on how to chill before you feel, please let me know in the comments. Thanks for listening. And until next time, my friends, be well and keep dreaming a good dream. Ciao for now.